Assalamualaikum. 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 How are you doing, Alhamdulillah. sister? Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Good. Um, I know in, in Malaysia, because this is my third interview with a Malaysian, mashallah, um, it's yeah, around Maghrib exactly. time. So you prayed, inshallah. You're yeah, good. Oh, okay. Alhamdulillah. 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 Okay. Alhamdulillah. Okay. Good. Um, before we start, um, Assalamu alaikum, salam lar, marhaba. Um, hello in your language, whatever language it is that you, um, that you speak, wherever, you are, wherever you're from, join us today on live, on FN Live Art Critiques. I'm your host, Alayth. I am the owner, the founder, the critique, um, the all around guy when it comes to this channel. Every Saturday, we do these interviews with are in the stages, are in the way. Of, in, the, in their way to making a big shock when it comes to um, Islamic art, and I think they need to be known right now, right? And need to be supported right now. So this is um, this is interview 14. If you're not seen interview the previous interviews, they're all on YouTube in various subtitles. Um, please go watch, go subscribe, etc. Um, our guest today on episode 14 um, is a sister from Malaysia. I'll let her introduce yourself herself. Sister, please um, salam again, and uh, please tell us what your name is, where you're from, and what you do briefly. Uh, okay, thank you for having me. Uh, my name is Mona Sufi, as in my Instagram. Um, I am a self-taught artist based in Malaysia, but I'm not Malaysian. Um, I'm from Yemen, so I left during the war, so I live here as a refugee. Mm, okay, uh, mashallah. Yeah. Yeah. So you do? Yeah. Mashallah. Okay. Uh, no, alhamdulillah. Uh, but we'll continue in English okay. um, for the sake of the people that are watching um, watching the interview. Um, I did kind of notice from you the way you looked. I was like, is that a Malaysian? But I didn't want I didn't want to say something that would offend. But now that you've confirmed it, <laughs> uh, alhamdulillah, I don't want to yeah. offend you or make it seem like um, I'm doubting if you're a Malaysian or what have you. Um, so tell us, um, sister, what got you into what got you into um, this form of art, geometry, uh, okay. geometric art? So basically, since I was a kid, I've never been interested in art at all. Um, I also never remember that I had okay. uh, an art class. Uh, also, during my study in university, I studied uh, medical laboratory. So, but during my university, mm. like I discovered the graphic design, and then I learned a bit about it, like uh, Photoshop, Illustrator, and this kind of design. But and then the wars happened, and yeah. then two years later, I left Yemen, and then I settled up here since 2016 so at the end of 2017 like i i was looking on youtube like uh, how to do a small card like uh, because i need to learn the language here because i just want to uh i was just a okay. speaker <laughs> so i'm new also in english and okay. then i wanted to like a card to put some more to remember it and memorize them so I just discovered the watercolor, okay. like, you would not believe that, like, my entire life, I've never seen or touched watercolor, like, even I thought, watercolor is this, like, in my entire life, I thought, this is a watercolor, and then when I okay. found out, like, it's an amazing medium, Like I try to draw some flowers, some building. Uh oh, we're having a connection issue here. Stamona, yes. Stamona, you hear us? She left, okay. Okay, let's try this. Um, salam, salam, comics. Um, seems like we had, okay. 
there she is again. Um, we had some kind of connection issue there. Um, inshallah, we'll try that again. Sorry about that. Oh, but this is uh, this is the real world. This Hello. is live, <laughs> so we have mistakes. Assalam. Assalam. Is it from you? Your connection. Uh, I I don't know. I don't know. Um, but khair, inshallah. Um, continue. So you said you were saying about watercolor, and you started um, started um, coloring um, flowers. Yeah, like I tried to like uh, to do some flowers, but I really didn't like the flowers. So I moved to the architect and building okay. came. And then one day in 2017, I was talking with my auntie about art because I know she is studying art. And guess what? She is she was studying in Prince's School Foundation in Jeddah. And then she okay. immediately sent me okay. some canvas and watercolor, but she never let me how to how to use this canvas. So again, I start to look how to use this canvas. Okay. Um, and then I made one pattern. It was like it wasn't perfect, but uh, I figured out how to use it and the canvas and do everything. Okay. So and then since that, she got me two class with Samira May. Uh, it was amazing. One for intermediate and. For painter, and then I finished them in less than two weeks, maybe. So I think since yeah. that day, it's like um, I was like uh, very interested in geometry more than anything in art. Mm. Mm. Okay, and you, well, you, you, I think you've, um, you've, you've got some skills because not only have have I taken attention of your work. Um, if my opinion counts for anything, but definitely Miss Margie Lake. Um, I don't know yeah, if yeah, you're, if you, you should yeah. know her. Um, if you don't know her, um, she's yeah. following you. So this is, um, that I means know, that yeah. you, you have something, uh, you have something special here. Um, because if anybody it's knows my page, they know how much, um, Miss Margie's work. Um, yeah, go ahead. She's very I, yeah. So I didn't have history. Yes, she is. Even when I start to learn geometric, so she convinced me to open Instagram and start to follow this talented and teacher, because okay. they always keep uh, like giving their uh, their experience and they explain everything, and they always give you advice if you ask them. Yeah. So like a few months and then uh, Margie like she followed me and then uh, Samira and then many many teachers that they they are teaching in press school and. It was so pleasing to see them. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. That it's very definitely encouraging. Um, you might only have one thousand followers, but um, one one big follower there um, means yeah, the world. I think, um, especially somebody like her and even yeah. Miss Samira. Yeah, 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 yeah. It it does take time, you know. Um, you know, um, you said you've been looking, you've been looking like since two thousand and sixteen or so. Um. But I say, as I've seen some things on your page that show that um, you're definitely not only the followers, but definitely um, catching the attention of people. Um, I saw the the cups, the cup design. Ah, that was related to. Uh, you, remember, you know what I'm talking yeah, about? Yeah, yeah, I remember that one. So because I told okay. you, like during my university, like I discovered the graphic design, and I was very impressed about this. Yeah. Uh, this major, but because my hometown didn't have this, or yeah. they didn't teach this, so I just keep self taught as a geometric. Yeah. And then when now because I I am able to draw by campus, like I improve my skill to even use the illustrator. So like in the future, I'm thinking okay. to do some tutorial like how you can draw geometric in illustrator. It just need time how to record the video and everything, because some people like. Um, mm -hmm. I remember in two thousand nineteen, I tried to teach like do some workshop and teach like a group, a small group of people, and I realized yeah. that they yeah. cannot like hold the campus or even use it. So maybe if I teach now, mm -hmm. I made some illustrator. They make like to do it because they like geometric, but. They never like they don't like how to use the campus. And also, yeah. like at the beginning, I okay. was going. Okay. Okay. Yes, I was going to ask you. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. Go ahead. You're going to. You're going to. 
So at the beginning, I was going to like to do some printing, but as I told you, I am in love with watercolor, so I kept in traditional. Like I kept the traditional medium and the traditional way. Yeah. For Islam. Yeah. Energy. Okay. Okay, mashallah. Um, yeah, I was actually you you mentioned you got to it before me. I was going to ask about those online courses, but um, you you've already explained to us um about that. Um, so the the cup design that I was talking about here. Um, did you eventually get it to a to a store, or what? What, what were you trying to do with that? Because uh, I didn't I didn't catch that on your uh, page. Okay. It just that one. It was a mock up, so you just download from okay from any website okay it's plain and then you okay. design an illustrator okay after you design illustrator you, yeah. you go to to photoshop to make the mock up and but i'm still interested like in Hello, hello. Do you hear me? Yeah, you, um, yeah. You, you. It, it kind of was spinning. You're doing that, um, that uh, forever spin here. Uh, so I didn't hear what you said. You said that um, you're still interested in, and then it cut off. I didn't hear you. Ah, uh, okay. I'm still interested in graphic design, like how to design it, like not just in traditional way, also in okay, in many software. So. That was the first attempt to me in okay. in Photoshop and Illustrator. So maybe one day I will send it to Cafe. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Okay. No, because I, it looked like you. Somebody holding a cup. I was. I, I don't think there were your hands. Um. Am I right? Am I wrong? Uh, this is just a mock-up, not not a photo. Like it was a plane, and I just support my my design. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. 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 Because it looked like yeah, it looked like somebody's hand. Or I thought maybe you got into a no, shop no, no. or something. Yes, somebody uh, commissioned you or what I have you, but uh, no. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. Well, inshallah, inshallah, at some point. Um, how about the the Ramadan decor? I saw the the geometric design at the at uh, the mall. Was that you no, as well? It's not mine, but you know, because Malaysia like has a, a multi culture, so they have like many yeah. occasions. They celebrate with Chinese, with Muslim, and they were Indian. And this design was for I think Ramadan yeah. or Eid, so it catched my eyes because it was a yeah. geometric. So I I took it okay. was like a pattern that I already know and I made before. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I thought that was you. I was like, wow, mashallah. <laughs> I was saying. You're doing some big things. Uh, inshallah, though. Inshallah. Yeah. Maybe next year. Maybe the year after or something. Yeah. Inshallah. Inshallah. Um. So so um. If you don't mind me asking, now you said you um you're a refugee coming okay. from Yemen. Now um, you speak English pretty well, and you've probably been learning the uh, local Malaysian um, language. How 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 that work out? I mean, were you speaking English uh, okay. before you had to you had to move, no, like or did before, you learn it within this time as well? Okay, before I came here, like I was you know a little bit about English. Like I can read, like I know the alphabet and okay. some words. Okay, but I was never able to make yeah. one sentence so when i came here like i started okay. the beginner i learned how to talk and, because most of the people here they speak english yeah especially in kl Kuala Lumpur. Ah. like they are english speakers so okay i didn't have like a chance to oh, okay because everyone here speaks english so it was speaks yeah, english so ah, okay i just learned english and i kept with english <laughs> Oh, so you don't speak Malay? Um, what what language do you speak in Malaysia? Malay. Um, you speak uh, Bahasa, I think. Malay, but, uh, I don't speak Malay. Malay, okay. 
<laughs> okay. Okay, well, I guess um if if English is good enough, then it's good it's enough. So Alhamdulillah. Okay, so how how is Hmm. Okay. Okay. Hello, hello. Yeah, yeah, I I hear you. You hear me? Ah, uh, sorry about that. Um, I think that was me this time. Like, um, my phone was doing something a little yeah. weird there. Um, so, uh, how is it? How is how is life over there as an immigrant from from a country that's so different, um, or to a country that's so different? Um, they're not Arabs. They, I mean, yes, you find Muslims, but um. definitely the culture is different the food and everything how 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 has life been adjusting okay. yeah 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 okay okay at the be your voice keep disconnecting hear me no hello can you hear me now yeah hello no, hello You hear me now? Yeah. Yeah, I hear you now. Yeah, I hear you. No, I was I was saying how is life um adjusting from an Arab country to somewhere that is predominantly you know, predominantly Malay and they speak a different language, different culture, what have you. Um even though yes, you can might find a lot of Muslims, I'm sure it's yeah. very different. Uh the culture was different. Also because I lived in a small hometown that with one culture, one There is no multicultural, but at the beginning it was hard because yeah I was like I left during the war alone. Uh, I'm not with my family. I just me and my brother. Okay. So it was like a difficult time at the mm. beginning, and I couldn't like adjust with everything, especially food because my entire life like yeah. I eat just one kind of food, and now I, there's a variety of food here. <laughs> But now, like I like everything, and the people are very helpful and nice. Like they, they always smile. Like at the beginning, I was okay, like, "Why? Why they are smiling? What? What's happening?" And now, like you just see me, like <laughs> I'm smiling to everyone. <laughs> no, yeah, yeah, mashallah, that's good. Um, that's good, definitely, definitely. I'm sure that's um, it's. It's a different culture, right? Um, definitely. Um, I know I've been to the Arab world before. and i know something about the smiling issue you know because we in, we in america we're very open we're very open so people talk to you they they tell you about their business private even private yeah, issues even, just without even, even knowing even you like they, so um so the uh, but my arab students people that i that i've met you know in the arab world they they find it very strange that why why is she, why why is all this talking talking let's stay let's to kill them let's to kill them go out to kill them right and so <laughs> <laughs> I I I understand that definitely. I understand yeah, that definitely. It was weird, but I like it. I like it. I cannot imagine like when I back to my yeah, yeah. and smile to everyone they will ask me why I'm smiling. <laughs> Because I use it to smile now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. But it's a good idea. It's, it's it's part of our sunnah, yeah, right? Um true. to smile. So alhamdulillah we I, we at least learned that. Um I I I definitely appreciate um what you're doing. I think you're very talented in the work. Um definitely I don't try to call people for these interviews unless I I see in them something special and I do see that you're um, you're talented. Um I want to definitely thank you for joining us today. Um you're definitely inspiring not only because you um you you are a refugee refugee moving to another country and still trying to figure out things but um but that didn't stop you that not stop you from moving forward and aspiring and doing um you know doing your thing um but also because you're doing it well you're not just doing it but you're doing it well um definitely want to thank you for joining us today um is, before we leave though i want you to tell us some one thing about you that if people heard it they would be very shocked 
they wouldn't expect it? Um, well, I think I said everything. Something good. It doesn't, uh... um, something good. <laughs> Maybe I use my art to like to move off from depression and anxiety. So yeah, I was suffering for this for three mm. years. And it was a good thing that to do it. Mm. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, definitely. I can relate to that. I think, um, and I think a lot of people can relate to that. Definitely, that um, being able to engross yourself in art in any art form, really. Um, it, whether it's poetry, whether it's whether it's drawing, painting, um, does is a form of therapy, definitely. Um, and one can express themselves through that. Uh, so, um, alhamdulillah, alhamdulillah, we see that um, you definitely look, you definitely look happy, you look healthy. So, um, inshallah, inshallah, things will things will definitely get better um, from where they are now. Um, thank you, sister, for show, uh, for joining us. Um, um, inshallah, in the future. And we'll be able to we able to chat some more and see that you've you've made a lot more progress yeah. when it comes to this art. Um, keep learning, keep pushing, inshallah. and um, yes, inshallah. And um, salam alaikum. Okay, thank you very much. Um, Thank you for joining us, ladies and gentlemen. Um, somebody was saying, uh, Yavash, 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 Kondusha. Um, yeah, sorry, but uh, what can we do about that? Inshallah, I'll we'll see you guys next, next time. Go watch the, the other videos. Watch this video. If you didn't understand it, um, make sure you go watch the video. Probably by the end of tonight, you can watch it. And um, you can watch it uh, with... Turkish dialect, um, sorry, Turkish um, subscript, um, subtitle, sorry, Persian, Farsi, um, English, obviously, and Arabic, Arabic, inshallah. Okay, yeah, okay. Um, inshallah, um, Da Sonra, um, Tukche, Alt Yazdalar, Alt Yazdalar, Alt Yazdalar, Warsa, War. Inshallah, <laughs> inshallah. Okay, inshallah. Bestat sonra, inshallah. Tukche, tukche. YouTube da, YouTube da. Tukche, um, what? Inshallah. Assalamualaikum.